Hey guys, good morning, what's up? It is Thursday, I've got two more days of work and then we've got a, an extended weekend um, for the 4th of July, so that's kind of what's going on. All I gotta do is get through the next 16 hours of work. Hmm. No, more than that, right? Because I work a 10 hour shift, so 20 hours, crap. That sucks. There doesn't seem to be a lot of traffic on the road, but it seems to be taking us forever to get where we're going. Hey guys, oh, what's up? I made it to work. I am looking at the parking lot and there's like nobody here. So I guess that's an indication of maybe not much work today or tomorrow. I don't know. <sighs> we'll just go with the flow, but I'm here. So let me cry. And then I'll walk into the office. Let's go get this day started. Hey guys, what's up? Good morning, it is Saturday. Greg and I are getting ready to head out for the day. Um, we already had our breakfast that he made. I think we're going out for lunch or dinner tonight. I'm not sure which. And actually, what time is it? I don't know, we might do lunch, who knows. And then Greg has brownies that he made last night that we're gonna go take over to his aunt house and she's got what does she have for us squash from her garden so we're gonna get that I've actually never had squash before crazy I know and Greg's actually never had squash before either so we're gonna do that Greg picked them and grew them when he was younger but he's never ate them so that's gonna be something new we were out in the garden this morning we've got cucumbers that are starting to pop up oh yeah look at how big that is I didn't see that one yesterday I told you they're, they're in cucumber camo. I don't know how we're gonna... Look, we could look in here and start searching for them. They're hard to spot some of them are. I don't know how we're gonna get into these and find them and pick them. Oh boy. Yesterday, Greg sent me a text message and, well, picture message, and he was like, hey, look, we've got cucumbers growing. And we really do. I went out and looked at them today. The um, tomatoes are doing really well. The pumpkin is growing, or pumpkins, I don't know. It, and see, it makes me uh, feel like not so bad when, when pumpkins cost so much because they take up a lot of real estate. Man, do they take up a lot of real estate. Now, <laughs> now, <laughs> now I understand, like when you go to the store and you see the cost of pumpkins, you can't complain because trust me, they take up a lot of real estate. This. Cantaloupe? cantaloupe. Yeah. We got cantaloupe? Mm -hmm. Oh, cantaloupe. we're growing cantaloupe, you guys. I didn't even cantaloupe know that. And three watermelons that are taking up from Yeah, and the watermelon is taking up a lot of space too. This is the watermelons. Yep, there's a nut look. There's one, two, Watermelon blooms. Seven. The corn is getting so big. When are we gonna see corn? I don't know. All right guys, so yeah, we're gonna head out. I am ready to get this day started. Let's go. So it's actually been a really long time since we went to go see Greg's aunt. Um, this is the basket she brought to us of eggs but we filled it with brownies and we're gonna take her some of these um lentils because they're really good we get them from costco but i think you could probably get them on amazon too i don't know but it only takes a minute and they're so good quick easy dinner hey guys so we got done um at greg's aunt's house and we checked out her garden and she has some different things than what we have so we got some squash i'm sorry the road's really bumpy right here um we got some squash that we took home and then she showed me they've got green beans which is something that greg and i are not growing and so we'll be getting some of the green beans from her and then of course she was showing me how the grapes are coming along which i had her grapes last year they were really good they're concord grapes and they've got the seeds in them but they're really good um i'm not sure what's going on with our grapes i'll have to discuss that with you guys another time i don't know if they're going to make it we're going to try um but we may have to order new ones for next year and what else oh and right now greg and i are getting ready to head out we're going to go meet his aunts <laughs> and his uncle and we're going to go to three hawks barbecue because they've never been and Greg has been wanting a are we getting a Bogart we're getting a Bogart so that's what we're gonna go do I will show you guys what we're getting when we get there amazing food. Oh, it's so bad it's good hey guys good morning I did not close out my vlog last night we had a really um 
long but fun day with family. We went um, out to Pennsylvania and as we're driving through we see like so many flags. Like when we go through Pennsylvania anyway there's so many flags. It's just very like patriotic and of course because it's July 4th weekend it's extra patriotic and it was just really really nice. So we're going through there and just enjoying the drive and then we got to um, Three Hogs Barbecue and Greg's aunt and uncle, they've never ate there before, so they got the Hungry Bogart, which is the same thing Greg and I got, and we just all split, you know, so like they got one order of the Hungry Bogart, and Greg and I got one order, and then we just split that um, between Greg and I, and then him and his wife split theirs, and that was really good, and then we paid for their meal, and then his aunt was like, okay, now I'm going to take you guys for a banana split. So then Greg and I split a banana split. He had more than I did because I'm like, I cannot, I cannot eat all this. So we did that and then we just kind of came home and relaxed until the fireworks started. And Digger was freaking out a little bit. So that was a bit stressful last night. And that's kind of like how our day ended. But it was really nice. It was just a beautiful day outside. Great company good food. You can't get better than that, right? Right. Alright guys, so we will see you guys in the next vlog. Don't forget to like, subscribe, share, do all that kind of stuff. If you guys do all three, as always, we promise to love you guys forever. See you next time. Alright, Greg and I were just talking and I told him that if we were to ever get pregnant, which we would never get pregnant, that I am going to name our daughter, because we would have a daughter. And what's our daughter's name going to be? I can't call it. <laughs> Stop. It's going to be Allison, right? But it's going to be spelled Allie, A-L-L-E-Y, Sin, S-I-N, Allie Sin, Allie